start with a slip knot and chain 16 one single crochet in the second chain from the hook this one and one single crochet in each and every stitch until the last stitch three single crochets in this last stitch it's a bit hard to work with jute yarn if you find it hard to pull out the stitches try changing the hook size And now turn your work and start working on the opposite side. One single crochet in each and every stitch until you reach the last stitch. This is our first stitch. And take this yarn in along with the working yarn. Three single crochets in this last stitch. And make a slip stitch on top of this first single crochet. Next round, start with chain one. This chain one it won't be counted as a stitch one single crochet in the same stitch and one single crochet each and every stitch until you reach the three single crochets over here Now we reach the three single crochets. Now make two single crochets each in these three stitches. One single crochet in each stitch until you reach the last three single crochets. Two single crochets each in these three stitches. This is the slip stitch and this is the chain one and this is the first single crochet. Make a slip stitch into this first single crochet. This base measures around 9 by 2 inches. Next round, start with chain 1. One single crochet in the same stitch. And one single crochet each and every stitch around. Once you reach the end, do not slip stitch. You will be working in continuous rounds. Now this round onwards keep repeating one single crochet in each and every stitch until you reach the size which you need. This is how it will look. Now to make the handle, just fold your piece in half and gauge the midpoint. This is the midpoint. Count back four stitches, one, two, three and four and mark the next stitch. 
Similarly from this point count back 4 stitches 1, 2, 3, 4 and mark the next stitch. In the same way mark the stitches on the other side as well. This stitch. Now make one single crochet in each stitch until this mark stitch. Chain 16. You can increase or decrease this chain stitches to change the size of the handle. Now continue with one single crochet in each and every stitch. Go into the stitch next to the mark stitch, this one. I repeat the same on this side as well, chain 16. Continue with one single crochet in each and every stitch. Go into the stitch next to the mark stitch. This is how it will look. The last round, one single crochet in each and every stitch. You can remove what the stitch mark is. Make 16 single crochets into this chain loops. Go below the whole stitch. This is how it will look. Now continue with one single crochet in each stitch. Repeat the same on this handle as well, 16 single crochets. Continue with 1 single crochet in each stitch. And once you reach then slip stitch and view of a yarn. I hope you like this video. Please do subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.